Casey, um, I am extremely excited to become your wife. Um, oh, sorry, um, I couldn't have picked a better person um, to spend the rest of my life with. I love you. <laughs> We're gathered here today to celebrate one of life's greatest moments, and that is to give recognition and worth to the beauty of committed marital love and for, for all of us to add our best wishes to the words <clears throat> that will unite Casey and Ann. My dear Ann, I promise to love and care for you always. I will be honest with you, kind, patient, and forgiving. I promise to try my hardest to always be on time. But most of all, I promise to be a true and loyal friend. And I will love, cherish, and cherish you for better or for worse, sickness and in health, always and forever. I love you. Casey, um, I always wanted to find true, unconditional, knock your socks off, eternal love. That kind of love is not something you can force, and I started to think it would never happen for me until now. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Not only have I found this kind of love with you, it's better than I ever imagined. You're smart, funny, kind, hardworking, understanding, and loving. You are all the things I dreamed of and more. From this moment, I take you as my best friend for life. I promise to stand by you through the good times and the bad. I promise to make, to work at our love and always make you a priority in my life. I promise to remember that neither one of us is perfect, but will always remind myself of the ways we are perfect for each other. I promise to love you, respect you, support you, and above all else, make sure I'm not just yelling at you because I'm hungry. <laughs> These are my vows to you, and I will keep them by continuing to love you every moment of every day with every beat of my heart. Let no man put these individual grains of sand apart, nor these two individual spirits after today. Just as these grains of sand cannot be separated, let these two never be separated again. The two of you have agreed to live together in matrimony. You have expressed that commitment to one another by exchanging these vows in front of these witnesses and by the authority vested in me by the Commonwealth of Virginia. I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride, sir. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor for the very first time to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Johnson. <laughs>